Hey, what's up, Rumblers? It's the Tan Man. Hello, Tan Man. And welcome back to my Heroic series. Today, we're taking on Inquisitor White Mane, a battle which requires perfect timing. You'll see what I mean, but enjoy the video, guys. Like and subscribe for more Warcraft Rumble content, and we'll see you in the endgame. Alright guys, we got Inquisitor White Mane. She always starts off with the Flame Elemental and Footman on the right, so it's nice to have flying units to take care of these guys. Um, these units do have elemental resist and armor, so it's important to bring flying units of both types, uh, both damage types. So we use harpies for the physical and drakes. And while well, we have Ren this time, we're fortunate to, for the elemental damage. Now, as you can see, they do also send their own drakes. So we can counter this effectively with the safe pilot. As you can see here, um, we let go of our drake to take care of the massive footmen. Now, you guys remember me saying that this fight requires utmost timing. Well, the heroic mechanic in this fight is that um, White Mane, no, I'm sorry, his, her helper, <laughs> Morgrain, that, that's it, I almost lost the name there, Morgrain um, heals himself in this, in this mode. And if you cannot push them down almost simultaneously, it's going to be very difficult. So what you'll see me doing, well, in the uh, early stages of this match is to push on Morgrain first. If you push on White Mane and get her down before you get Morgrain down, Morgrain is just going to heal her to, to full health. So push Morgrain and get her down to maybe about 50%. And at that time, you almost kind of want to trust your units on the right to finish him off. Um, and... Hopefully you get control of the Waystone because once he dies, like uh, as you see here, he's actually dead. He's on the ground. I wasn't able to um, get this Waystone in time and uh, as a result, I wasn't able to send my remaining troops on top of White Mane to finish her off. So as you can see, Morgrain is at full health now, but we did get squeeze in some damage on White Mane, which is going to help us um, as you will see. So we... We let this Drake come in because we don't have the safe pilot. We don't want to throw units into it. And we got our Drake down, coming down to take care of the footmen. Now, Morgan's taking dam, right? We're almost dead ourselves. And we're going to just rally in for one last push. We don't want to send all of our gold into Morgan, like into the late stages of this match, because we know for a fact we will be... Um, we'll have to swing our momentum over to the left side. When Morgrain dies, he does consecrate the ground and will nuke all of your troops on the right side. This is very unlikely for them to actually make it over to White Main. My guys on the right side get killed by a Drake, and I actually didn't end up killing Morgrain first. And, well, you can see how hairy it gets right now. So I send in my safe pilot to finish him off but as you can see like he was actually channeling into white main if he didn't die right then and there white main would have been healed to f like full health and with more grain down you have a precious few seconds to finish off white main before she reses him so i hope this helps you guys good luck on the fight and we'll see you in the end game subscribe